Come on. Good boy. So, good boy. Yesterday's video was me brushing Jack and just getting him used to the brush. Today's video is going to be the same thing with Teddy because Teddy's the one that needs the brushing. I just like to desensitize both of them to the brush. And I looked up a few videos on how to get your dog used to the brush. The biggest tip I have for you guys is give your dog something to do. Like chew on a bone or give your dog something to do. Like chew on a bone or like, I don't know, like, like put peanut butter in a Kong so the dog has to work at it in order to, so you can brush them. Like work at, like chew out the treat and stuff in order for you to brush them. And he barely sheds, that's all the hair that I've gotten off him. And some of it's the cat's hair, but some of it's Teddy's hair. So, and then when I go outside, I de-fluff it. So I take all the fluff that I've gotten from Jack or Teddy, and I rip all the fluff out so the wind can take it and the birds can make nests and stuff. Okay. Right now, Teddy's pretty much desensitized to the, bar, to, the, to the brush. So what I'm going to do is send him to a spot. Come. Come on. Spot. Teddy, spot. So, and then now, I'm gonna give him sort of a belly rub with a brush. He's like, why did you stop? So right now I'm gonna give him a belly rub with a brush, just to like, and you know, just to like give him a brushing on the, his belly a brush. <laughs> his belly fur brush. But do you know what is so weird is when he was a puppy, he used to bite at the brush. And so that's where I got the idea to give him like a Kong or, or a bone to chew while I brush to give him that positive association So, now that Teddy's, stay, Four. 
stay. So I'm just going to give him a belly rub. Teddy, come here. Teddy, come here. Since you did so well with the brush, come. Sit. Here's a treat. Stay. Focus. Good job. Good boy.